it's a little bit frustrating to have a world that is so divided. And it's nothing new. It's been divided for a long time. There have always been conflicts between human critters and other kinds of critters. But to see all the division and, and people upset with each other and calling each other stupid and mean and uncaring and, and all this stuff. And, and it's really frustrating when I hear those occasional voices of what I think are reason. People that are agreeing with the outcome that I've, I've arrived at, which could be wrong, but they happen to agree with me. I'm like, oh, yay, there's another person that maybe thinks how I do. Very rarely do they think how I do. Very few of the people that think what I think, think how I do. Listen to my words. How we think is different than what we think. We might both agree that an apple is good. You might have arrived at that conclusion as, or by the means of, I like things that taste good, I like things that are crunchy and mealy, I like things that have a little bit of sweetness, I like things that are healthy, and therefore an apple meets all of those things, therefore an apple is good. That's logical, that's reasonable. I might also say, I like apples. But how I came to that conclusion was, blue cars are pretty. Well, that's stupid. How I think was wrong, not what I think. Apples can still be good. Now, what I'm talking about are just some very basic, simple, beginning, inner, just the entry-level stuff of logic. You haven't heard of this, probably. CNN doesn't want you to hear this. Fox News doesn't want you to hear this. For mercy's sake, government schools don't want you to hear this. The politicians don't want you to think this way. They want you to go by emotion. Is it really too much to ask people to wear elbow guards? You just never know when you're going to bump into somebody in the grocery store that might have a, a, a special bone issue that just bumping into them could crush them. Is it really too big of an ask to ask people to wear padded elbow braces? And then they'll say this to you and you go, wow, that really seems sweet. Wow, that makes sense. What a jerk I would be if I didn't wear padded elbow braces. No, that's ridiculous. Think about statistics. Think about science. Think about the scientific method. Think about logic. Figure out how to read graphs. For those of you that are already on board with this and like know a little bit, whether you completely disagree with me in the outcomes, that's very possible. But for those of you that are already on board and, and kind of think well, even if you think differently, you think well, the process you use to think and calculate, geez, thank you. The world needs more people like you. And frankly, I'm not real thrilled with the other 99 point whatever percent of people out there. I'm kind of getting disgusted. And not only do people not know how to think, they don't want to learn how to think. And that's really frustrating for a thinker. I might be dumb. I might come up with all the wrong conclusions, but I think. And I have a system for doing it. And it hasn't been proven an incorrect system. Won't some of you please just think with me?